One day after province-wide protests to highlight the concerns students have regarding rising tuition and debt, the Minister of Training, Colleges and Universities was in Windsor promoting the grant. A grant, he says, thousands of students have yet to apply for. Here's our Sasha Long. Like that. Student protesters are showing little faith in Ontario's tuition grants. Upset because it feels like we were lied to. With numerous restrictions, many believe the 30% tuition grant isn't what the McGuinty government promised during the elections. They say the tuition fee reduction should apply to all students, but only 34% of students qualify. Every student should qualify for it. Uh, a tuition refund that, does, that benefits the minority and not the majority is, is really uh, not much help to us at all. The Minister of Training, College and universities was at the University of Windsor to promote the new grant as a $1,600 a year discount on a university education. It is not the end. It is the third major tuition uh, assistance program we have initiated in the last eight years. In addition to part-time, graduate and international students, those excluded from the grant include mature students and those whose parents make over 160000 a year, people like Jordan Mills. It's actually disappointing because, I mean, like it's not my fault that they have those jobs. With no government help, she expects a hefty debt when she graduates. It's close to like $50,000 when it's all said and done. It's pretty scary. Yet Minister Glenn Murray points to the fact that many aren't even taking advantage of it. We have 90,000 students of the 310,000 who haven't yet signed up. At the University of Windsor, 8,000 students are eligible for the grant, yet only 1,800 students have signed up. Have you applied for it? Uh, I am going to be soon, hopefully. Why haven't you yet? Uh, because I didn't have the time. <laughs> I, know, I was waiting to see where, like, where to apply and how, I guess. When students say there's a demand for student aid, that's much more credible if the program sells out overnight. We know you need it. Sasha Long, CTV News.